Good morning. My name is Michelle Stowers, and I currently serve as an elder at Village Presbyterian Church. We are all called to care for the earth as part of our PCUSA global mission. The overwhelming majority of climate scientists agree global warming is real. There are so many ways we can all make small changes that can lead to big differences for our children and generations to come. I want to speak this morning about local, sustainable, and regenerative agriculture. I think the pandemic has highlighted how vulnerable our industrial food system is. I'm guessing you also noticed the lack of produce on grocery store shelves in the early days of COVID. Our food often travels hundreds, if not thousands of miles to reach our plates in Kansas City. But this doesn't have to be the case. I've long been passionate about the local food movement. My great grandparents were extensive backyard gardeners in East Texas. They were food, not lawns people before that was a movement. Fresh produce was part of our daily lives. The farmer's market is still one of my favorite places in the world. I became interested in the local urban ag movement and got involved with Cultivate Kansas City eight years ago and their new Roots for Refugees training program. The program is a partnership with Catholic Charities and they assist immigrants as they learn about our Midwestern growing climate to become successful market farmers. These are the folks you often see at your local farmers markets. My time in Johnson County Community College at the Sustainable Ag Program taught me how to grow without chemicals and pesticides and apply these sustainable growing techniques. My eyes were open to the downside of industrial ag and the planting of monocultures. This approach has stripped our soils, not only of important nutrients, but leaves our fields vulnerable to both droughts and floods which is unfortunately becoming a new normal with climate change. I'm not expecting everyone to dig in as deep as I have, nor bury yourself in health um, and healthy soils, but a few easy suggestions could be, grow vegetables in your own backyard, support the many local farmers that show up each week at our local farmers markets, or volunteer at the Village Church Food Pantry Garden, which provides fresh produce to our pantry clients. When we know better, we do better. Like many of you, I want to be part of the solution. God is calling each of us to save the earth in our own way, one small change at a time. I encourage you to join me.